what is the million dollar time hack <laughs> dude I'm, i love the fact that you dove so much into this that's fucking oh awesome. this book so, is great this book oh is thanks dude. so so i had to come up with this because i wasn't always honoring my own commitments in the sales process okay, okay. so they're, they're like, you need to schedule your business development time, right? You need to schedule your call time, right? Those things need to be hard, fast. And I found myself at different times, whether it was running my own company or working for others, that I didn't honor that window of time to do the business development stuff, the prospecting and the, and the likes. Right. And that's always cost me. Every time that I did not honor my business development activities, it cost me. And by the way, um, it's I, it is one of the most common issues when people start up businesses, particularly if you're in the service business. They work really hard to get some job project, yep. then they're working sixty yep. hours a week on the project, and then the project ends, and they're like, oh, "What the oh, fuck?" Oh shit! Do do yeah, exactly. Right? Yeah, exactly. So this was the way I fixed it for me. Right. So I'll ask you it the same way I did it in the book because I thought I still think it's funny. Is if you had an appointment with a client that was worth a million fucking dollars <laughs> would anything in the world keep you from barring your family member dying bar you from being at that fucking appointment i will ask you a question and because i ask this question when people uh, say to me that they've been they were late to i'll give you an example last week i had to change well i had to change our appointment you know we were into the, this interview um because something had come up okay yep. and what happened was I chose that something over you, yep. right? It was a, a life is full of options. We're always making For sure. Choices. If you had said to me, Hey, Gene, I'll give you a million dollars for us to, for you to be on that call so we can have our, you know, our interview last week. Trust me when I tell you. <laughs> <laughs> well, the other thing did no longer matter. <laughs> the other thing suddenly went out of that, right? Because we're sure. all making those choices. I get that's the million dollar time act, isn't that, it? That's it. Is yeah. you got to treat whatever that activity is that you have to get done as if it's worth a million dollars and yeah. for me i always look at it from that perspective I me mean, i've yeah. closed million dollar deals and you know so i know the rush and things that comes from that yeah. so so when you look at it and for me i use it specifically for business development is every business development time slot is a million dollar activity and you're just not going to miss it you know barring my wife calling me and say the house is burning down right 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 well it, it, it's full of options and that is a great way to evaluate that was the other thing i always uh, use that I'm, I'm a big like on time guy like i always oh, feel like sure. you're either you know you're either long you're either on time or you're late and there's no such thing as being early and uh and whenever people are late for stuff i always say to them, and they're oh i'm so sorry traffic was so bad you know whatever and i always think to myself dude if I told you that if you were on time, you get a million dollars, you would have been on time. You know, yep. <laughs> you would have left that much. Or so it's all those choices that you make that involve your time, which impacts other people. You know, the decision. 100%. Right. 